lot. And this is, uh, let me tell you something, this has got everything. Olives, with banana peppers, which are yellow peppers. It's got cucumbers, it's got spinach, uh, green peppers, olives, oregano. I put red wine vinegar, uh, buffalo sauce, and honey mustard. Also mayonnaise. And it's got everything. It's got turkey and chipotle cheese and tomatoes and stuff like that. These are the good foods that people need, turkey subs. And um, I used Publix and horse head bread. It's too expensive. I got onions here too. I use Publix bread, wheat bread, and not boar's head because it's way expensive. But it's got the most delicious of all vegetables. And this is the kind of stuff people need to eat and uh, get their exercise, workout, jogging, swimming, gymnastics, kung fu, martial arts, training, whatever you do. Because this is the kind of stuff that makes you healthy, healthy and immune from sickness and disease as long as you keep up uh, working and the working out and the strenuous activity and uh, everything that else that, that increases your uh, you immunity from all sicknesses, diseases, and viruses, and no one needs to catch that. So you have to make yourself immune by some strenuous work in your household, the work you do, or just also, I would also include workout, which is exercise, which includes like flexibility exercises, like stretching. Other than that, I just want to leave you with that good message about the good food I eat. And I don't care what anybody else thinks about me making videos on my YouTube channel about food. All right, then this is Jeffrey Scott Marlowe. I'm going to enjoy the sub. This is only half of it, and I got another half too. It's real delicious. I finished the sweet potato chips, and I have my uh, red high C mixed with the uh, blue Powerade, so whatever. It's got vitamins in it. I'll enjoy it, <clears throat> and I uh, hope everybody else does too, and practices their stretching and exercises and increasing their immunity and keeping the Saturday Sabbath also, unlike Chinese and Chinese kings like the Chinese king trying to force people to worship him when he is not God and starting off with China who worship idols in the first place which is a sin and you shouldn't worship idols that's one of the first and second commandments the ten commandments of the Bible and uh, also the fourth commandment is to keep Sabbath holy and that Sabbath is Saturday according to Bible Flybox Hope Through Prophecy and Doug Bachelor also with amazing facts that is Doug Bachelor. alright y'all have a nice day